<laughs> it's not just a picture of him. It's a picture of him in his car. And obviously, the girl that's going for it. Let's see what she says. Sounds like a date to me. A toe digger, literally. Well, those winnings are actually mine. Damn! She got a prenup. What's good with the gang? Welcome back to Vons. POV. We are back with another banger video for you guys today. And as y'all can see from the title, man, we are reacting to a Dar Men video. And this one is Dad Becomes a Millionaire and Leaves His Family. He Lives to Regret It. That sounds crazy, actually. I'm not gonna lie. Like, so you telling me like you you damn near win the lotto and you walk out on your family? I want to see why his intentions were what they are. We're going to go ahead and get into this, man. As always, before we get into the video, though, if you guys could please, please, please make sure you have your notifications on and make sure that you guys are subscribed. That way you do not miss any of the uploads on the channel as we are uploading on the channel every single day throughout the rest of the year. Follow my social media links in the description down below. If you guys want to tag me in your favorite part of the video, I will repost you guys on my Instagram. Gaming channel link in the description down below if you guys want to subscribe to the other channel and come over there for some of the live streams. You guys are more than welcome. Where's your video down below? As always, we're gonna go ahead and get right into it. What? what are, are they eating spaghettios? What's wrong? Oh, nothing. I just love eating the same cute thing little family five though. times a week, Erica. I only make pasta for you because I thought it was your favorite. Yeah. You've never complained before. Yeah, well, it's getting old. Okay, we starting off this episode no, it's fine. It's fine. intensely. Well, maybe we could go out to dinner. You and me. Like, ain't, no way. ain't no way! Ain't no way! Bruh, that's how we starting off the episode. <laughs> he literally talking to his wife and her and another girl's picture on Instagram while talking to her. Hey man, he got spaghettios on his plate. <laughs> Drew, what? I was just saying you should take me out to dinner. If you were listening to me instead of liking some girl's photo. If you look like her, then maybe I'll take you out. What was that supposed to mean? Whoa, 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 whoa. Why? Whoa! Why? Pause! Pause, okay? Because first of all, she is a beautiful black queen. Okay, so the girl you was just liking on Instagram, she ain't got nothing on her. I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. He, he kind of just went in, bro. He went in. Went in. Like I hope. All the time. Bruh, I hope so he is right. to dress up to cook and clean. Let me, yeah. Uh, I just gotta hey, work. Hey, hey, hey I'm Maybe single. You know what I mean? I can slide through. You know what I mean? What's up? Let me chat. Let me, let me, let me chat. No, Eve. We don't throw food, okay? Oh, I thought he threw you food. You want mommy to feed you? I want daddy to feed me. <laughs> Even if I wanted to go out, it's not like we can. We both decided to have a kid, True. Facts. And if you plan ahead, we can get mom to babysit. We can go out for New Year's. Please. I'd rather eat the spaghetti every day for the entire year than ask your mom for help. If we had a nanny like I've been telling you, then we actually have a life. Instead of this same old routine day after day. Now, how are we supposed to afford a nanny? Hmm? And even if we could, do you really want a nanny to raise our little girl? Right, 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 right. What are you right. going to do when she starts calling a nanny instead of you? Mmm. I hope that happens. I, that way I, I can finally get a break. I like this episode already. I like this. I can't do this right now. I don't know how I'm going to survive a whole nother year living like this. I want daddy there ain't to no way. me. Daddy's busy, baby. All right, let's show today's lottery number. Let mommy teach you, okay? Ah, uh, shoot, he about to win the lotto. And coming up next, we have weather. Oof. Yo, check this out. I wish my wife looked like this. 
Don't you wish you were too? <laughs> All right, I ain't gonna lie. He, he going lunatic, bro. Okay, I'm gonna keep it 100. He is going crazy right now, bro. I love my life. I really this man, look, life. he look 40. He on Instagram talking about looking at girls me. that look like they If a girl like that wanted to go on a date with you, you say no. I would. You know, you might think that the grass is greener on the other side, but that's not always the case. Hey. Yes, hey. it is. It's a the grass fact. on my side is dead. Like Erica completely let herself go after we had Eve. And she looks nothing like she used to. Well, maybe you should try watering the grass. Mmm! I'm serious. Oh! Hit him with, hit him where it hurts then! Serious. I like this When was the last time that you actually took your wife out on a date? Brought her flowers, took her to a movie? I think if you put in a little bit of effort, things would change. If she looked like this, I would love to take Erica out. Shoot. I'd take her out. Every day. Okay. Well, then why don't you go ahead and get a divorce and date her instead? <laughs> you think I want a donor already? If I could. Girls like this only go out with guys with money, drive Ferraris, and live in mansions. Not that's not true, though. Like me. And that's the kind of woman that you want to be with—the one that's only in it for the money. Right. Gold diggers. Gold <laughs> diggers. Right. You know what they say? Not everything that glitters turns out to be gold. Well, mm. She clearly looks like gold to me. He's trying to just happy he's trying to just, he's trying to get in him. Yeah, well, I hope next year is really happy because this year has been horrible. Well, there's one thing you can do to turn things around. No one won last night. Jackpot's up to seven million. Hmm. Seven million. No thanks. We're okay. Are you sure? Be a brand new life. What the heck? Let's do it. What? I'll take you out to dinner if I win. You should be taking your wife out. Mm. He going crazy. <laughs> I ain't like, he going crazy. He going Eve, in, bro. quiet down. Can you read me a book, Daddy? Not now, I'm busy. You never make any time for her. Man, he's treating his daughter like crap, that. bro. I ain't gonna lie. Is she cute? She a little cutie. Once upon a time, everyone lived happily ever after. The end. Bro, wait, what? You didn't have to do that. Don't start with me. Why are you so grumpy all the time? Huh? Did you even notice I made you something new? I swear, you don't even appreciate anything that I do for you. Appreciate what? Eating the same thing five out of seven days a week? This food's not even good. Appreciate it. I come in after a long day's work. Hearing you nagging, my daughter crying, you. And you looking like that. Good. I ain't gonna lie, she got some cheeks. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> All right, let me chill. Let me chill. Good. Let me chill, Please. bro. Let me chill, bro. Here are I ain't gonna lie, he is. Four, thirty-seven, twelve. No way. Twenty-three. What? Eighteen. You gotta be kidding me. And forty-one. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! I can't believe this! No! Oh! What? What? What's going on? I won! That's what happened! I can't believe it! Seven million dollars! Oh no! Wait! No, but you say, you say we won seven million dollars. Oh, well, we. What do you mean we? Wait, ain't no way. Uh, me, I just won, not you. Oh, what are you? <laughs> this is. What? I don't have to live like this anymore. This is the best day of my life. What, <laughs> Drew? Where are you going? To start a new life. Bruh, I wonder if somebody really that 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 probably has happened before, bro. He this walked out on his family and all my dreams bro. are about to come true in 2023. Oh man, I'm so happy for you. And to think I tried to talk you out of buying that ticket. To win, How to does Erica feel to about win about the lotto in 2023, bro? Clearly, to start there, that'd be crazy. Come on, Jake. I don't need her anymore. I have money, and that's why I've hired. 
A divorce attorney? Come on, man, how can you do this? Uh, well, Erica hasn't done anything to you. Yeah, well, right. she hasn't done anything for me either. I could finally find someone better. How can you say that after Erica's been there for you through thick and thin? Right. Well, lately. Right. That part. I, thick. I love this episode, bro. Next. I just can't believe what you're saying, man. Happy New Year. Uh, I would like to make a withdrawal from my new account. And can you tell me the balance, please? Sure. What about your daughter? Uh, she'll get over it. <laughs> what? I'll have her stay with me from time to time. Especially now, I could finally hire nannies to watch her. And with all the new toys you have, the last thing she'll be worried about is having me around. Here you go. Have you seen such a big number in your life? Gosh, you are making a huge mistake, man. There's a reason that most lotto winners end up depressed. <sighs> well, uh, if I'm ever feeling down and out, I can always check my bank balance and I'll lift me right back up again. I would like to take out 10 grand. You know, some pocket change for the weekend. He going crazy. Drew is excited. Lie, look, at, look, at, look at the banker. She looking at him like, oh, okay, I see you, big daddy. Ooh. Start his new going life crazy, as though. a millionaire. Within a short time, he separates from his wife and files for divorce. Now that he's rich and single, he decides to buy himself a brand new mansion. With a new Ferrari to go along with it. That Ferrari clean though, I can't even After lie. After he moves into his new place, he hires a personal chef to make him everything he wants. So he no longer has to eat the same thing every day. He even gets a nanny to take care of his daughter. When Eve seems sad, he just spoils her with gifts to keep her distracted while he goes out and enjoys his new life of luxury. It doesn't take Drew long to even land the girl of his dreams. Everything seems to be falling into place. Y'all notice that, right? Y'all notice that. Look, girl of his dream. look at the picture. It's not just a picture of him. It's a picture of him in his car. And obviously, the girl that's going for it. Let's see what she says. Sounds like a date to me. A gold digger, literally. Everything yeah. seems to be falling into place. Once she sees how rich he is, she and really starts to you like know. him. Drew's living the life he always dreamed of. He, he just wanted to go Little crazy. Little did he know, things were he about to come crashing down. Thank you. She was just looking at a businessman herself. So, I was thinking we should go on vacation next week. I've never been to Europe. Have you? Uh, hello? Sorry, what did you say? Nothing. It's not important. I'll be right back. I gotta go to the ladies' room. He getting that same treatment? That, the, the same treatment he was doing to his wife. No, ain't no way he going through a phone. He just met the girl. Ain't no way, bro. I left my... What do you think you're doing? Me? What are you doing talking to all these guys? Especially She's a gold the digger, bro. She's so, a thot. What do you like expect? I'm the only girl you're talking to? Actually, you are. Oh. Okay. Well... I don't know what to say. Sorry, I gotta take this. Walter, hi! No, I'm not busy at all. I was just out with a friend. Hey, what no. are you doing? It's a white dude, and too. <laughs> here is the pasta you ordered. Oh, way, bro. Bon appetit. <laughs> Start talking about some bon appetit. I'm bon appetit. Hey, that's tough. I ain't gonna lie. That's tough. You're home early. Oh, yeah. Well, my date was shorter than expected. You go home now if you like. Okay. Good night, Eve. I'll see you tomorrow. I don't want you to leave. Oh, no, it's okay, sweetie. I can put you to sleep. Thank you, Josie. Great. Well, I hope you have more fun than Daddy did tonight. I want a bedtime story. Sure, no problem. All right. Once upon a time... I don't want you to read it. I want 
want Josie to read it to me, or mm. Mommy. Mommy's not here right now, and Josie had to go home back to her family. So, Daddy's gonna read to you. But I want Josie. That's what Mama Duke said was gonna happen. And he learning his lesson right now, bro. I ain't gonna lie, he learning his lesson right now. Erica. I saw your car outside, I know you're in there. Can we talk for a minute, please? Erica. What do you want? Erica, I messed up real bad. I thought I had everything that I wanted, but I didn't understand that I already had everything that I needed. To be honest, I miss you. I miss our daughter. Let me find out she married already and got I a new guy. Cooking. So please give me one more chance. I'm sorry, I can't do that. Come on. Look, I know I've always been so miserable and after experiencing everything, I, I promise I'll be a lot happier. That's the problem, Drew. Everything is always about you and your happiness. Mm. Never mind. Mm. Did you ever think to ask, how am I doing? No. Nope. How I felt? No. Nope. Since you never asked, I'll tell you. You see, I've been working 50 hour weeks at a minimum wage job where my boss doesn't even appreciate me. Then I come home, take care of Eve, clean the house and cook dinner for you. Even though I am so tired and stressed out, I always put on my best smile for you. Yet, you don't even care to ask me how my day was. Then, when you left, I was devastated. I thought my life was over. But Damn, this shit hurting right now, bro. I realize I don't need you to make me happy. I'm perfectly fine on my own and with my daughter. So you see, just because you complained all the time, it doesn't mean I was miserable too. I just never showed it because I I'm wanted so to be there for you. I'm so sorry, Erica. Erica. I thought about all the things that, that I didn't have That I forgot to be grateful for the things that I did have And I realize now That not everything that glitters turns out to be gold It's too late, Drew mm. It's over now Please, please Please say goodbye to your face before I go. Please. Wow. You look beautiful. And I mean, damn. Why are y'all dressed up? Well, because. Hey, Rick. Sorry, this is my ex-husband. No, no problem. It's nice to meet you. Yeah. And Rick looking bald on the top of the head. My man's over here got waves. I mean, damn, the uglier dude came in and got her. Because he treats her better, bro. It's not all about looks. You feel me? You look absolutely stunning. <laughs> You're so sweet. Oh, I love roses. You don't do it, another man will. Thank you. Shall we? Absolutely. Let's go. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> 
Wait, yeah. wait, wait. But I've got way more money than him. <sighs> Not about Maybe. the money. But you don't have more money than me. Oh, well, Rick here is an attorney. And he reminded me that California is a community property state. So, half of those winnings are actually mine. Damn! She got a prenup! I'd slow down on the spending if I were you. My attorney will be in touch with you soon. Take care, Drew. Bro, this episode was insane, bro. Oh my God. Oh my God, bro. I didn't think she would finna clap back like that. Like, I know that that's a thing. Like, like getting a divorce and all that and half and, and half goes to the women, to, to, to the woman. But I didn't even, it didn't even cross my mind watching this to think that that's what she was gonna do, bro. She, she not only, <laughs> damn, he took an L, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He took a fat L, bro. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys know anybody that might have experiences or if this is something that you guys have experienced. This is a life lesson right here, man. A very big life lesson. I love you guys, man. I will see you guys in the next one. Original video down below. As always, if you guys want to watch the video without me talking and screaming over it. But yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. We are out.